Hello my people, welcome back to my channel. I'm Cindy B and this is Real Life with Cindy B Reactions and more. Thank you very much for joining me. If you have not already, please hit that like button and if you have not already, please hit that subscribe button and ring that little notification bell so you'll be notified every time I upload. So I'm in the kitchen and uh, you know I gotta have my nightly juice. So I am about to start this and tonight we're just going to use one apple and of course I have my tea tonight I'm having um, the twinnings twinnings or twinings lemon and ginger I have two packs in the coffee pot and water's already in there and I'm turning that on What do I need? I need my cutting board. That's what I need. And I am going to go ahead and pull this out. I'm a little closer. I'm going to push this cover pot back. And I'm going to go ahead and wash my I'm not sure why the picture looks so washed out tonight. So we have here two carrots. No, we have four carrots tonight because they're a little smaller than the ones I had last night. Oh, and I have three stalks of uh, celery. And I again tonight have decided to not add the uh, the beets. That's what I have decided. But I might change my mind because you know, you know me. I may change my mind. We'll see. For those of you who do not enjoy the sound of running water, you probably will not like this video. But I enjoy the sound of running water and uh, I enjoy the sound of appliances in operation and use. Enjoy the sounds that people make in the kitchen, etc. Sound of packages being handled, I enjoy all of that. I'm very much so into ASMR.
The only thing I don't like about ASMR is all the whispering. So you won't hear me doing whispering over here on my channel. You'll just hear ASMR sounds, but um, not the whispering. I find that the whispering to be terribly annoying. <laughs> and the only time I do the whispering is when I'm playing around. So, my juicing machine requires you to remove the skin.
ouch. I lost a chunk of my apple. So I, I lost a chunk of my apple and so I am actually going to add another one. It's going to be two apples anyway. how good it tasted last night and tonight I remembered to do it all in the right order and it worked out a whole lot better to do the softer stuff first but since I lost my big piece of apple on the floor I'm going to go ahead and put this apple in anyway. Yeah, the strainer looks good, so I think I'll be okay. And I put it back in. Ready, the juice is ready. And, uh, now we begin the cleanup. There's my 
edges. Kind of set it aside. a really good juicer but I have had a really good quality juicer where when you finished if you tried to squeeze what was remaining you would not get any liquid <laughs> I mean that thing was powerful it was the Omega XL the Omega something 2000 but they don't make that one anymore and I understand and when I bought it back in the day it was a heavy piece of equipment and it was metal. I have since seen them on uh, eBay and the people who uh, are buying the new Omegas are saying that they just don't make them the way they used to and they, are, they have been breaking down. So that's why I didn't get an Omega this time. That thing cost back then, I got the one that was $200. And then the one above it was, uh, they had the one for $1.99. And, the, oh shoot, there goes my tea. I got soapy water in the tea, so we can't have the tea. I can't believe I did that. It just, you, did you see that? So I messed up my tea, people. The soapy water went directly in it. And I usually turn it around so that, yeah. But I messed that up. Yeah, I'm kind of bummed out about that because everything was going so smoothly. But I wasn't going to have it immediately anyway. I was going to have it after my last ride. I just like to make it ahead of time and let it sit there. Because I know that once I drink this juice, I'm going um, <clears throat> to the bike for my last ride for the night. I just messed up my tea. Okay, I watched the soap go directly in it. I sure not did. So I will put the tea, I will put the coffee pot on the other side. Because this is a little thing that I do every day. So now I'm going to put the, uh, from now on, the coffee pot is going to sit on the other side. And this coffee pot is going to be replaced because I want the uh, the beautiful brand that's available oh, that has is attached to Drew Barrymore's name. My uh, air fryers are Drew Barrymore and they work quite well. And I want my full size coffee pot to match, so I'm going to be getting that in a few months. And I'm not dumb. I'm, I would not put that on my wish list at Amazon because Amazon is asking far more than um, Walmart is. I did a better job of washing this tonight than I did yesterday. Okay, now I need this thing so that I can uh, clean that up. Yeah, messed up my tea. That's two, two bags of tea I got in there, too. 
tin is not cheap, my people. But at least I caught it happening and I didn't drink soapy water tea. At least now I know. Put my coffee pot on the other side. Okay, so that was easy tonight. Back in the day, I mean way, way, way back in the day, I would have looked at this and I would say, oh no, no, it's brewing. The video was brewing, but now it's starting all over. I'd be so bummed out. But believe it or not, there was a time in my life where um, I was in pursuit of perfection. I felt like one teeny tiny little error, one teeny tiny little setback just spoke of a great failure. And that came from uh, years of being told by uh, my mother that I was never going to amount to anything. And then followed by years of somebody else in my family. Saying some of it. And now, you know, I just roll away to bed. So, but you know, this tea is not cheap. So tonight, I'm just going to, I like it made with two packs, but I'm just gonna do um, one pack tonight. Now that I have uh, already wasted two. I'm more disappointed over the fact that that's, you know, money lost. You only get 20 packs in the box. and I'll, will not be buying any more tea till next month. I treated myself to three boxes of it. Um, this one. Yep, I did. Okay, so I need to stop wiping over this because I'm just going to get it wet again. So let me clean this off. And my tea is uh, doing its thing again. Yeah, I wouldn't waste any money on a on a tea machine <laughs> or any of that stuff. What do you what do you call it? The Mr. T machine? I would do that. Use my coffee cup. My coffee maker. Okay, so I got that cleaned off. And dry it all. I got my juice right here. Turn it. Ooh, I was getting ready to do it again because now I, I got to rinse the dishes. Slide you over here. Okay. There you go. Hang out over 
this. Alright, that's done. Now I'm just going to rinse these dishes. See, the cleanup for a juicing is really, really a little something. I'll do what I just do. I do these parts. I believe this particular machine says that these parts are not replaceable. <laughs> I think that's what it says. I could be wrong. I'm late with my juicing because I, uh, I was working on something on a computer trying to figure something out after I had done my thumbnails and uploaded my stuff. And I sat there for a while trying to, trying to fix something. And it was a lemon. I was cutting a lemon metal. So that's what's for my juicing today.
Hello. Carrots went dry. That's what happens. That's what happens when you're not. Put it in my storage container. Stuff that goes into the trash in the morning. sure if I was going to have my berries tonight, throw my berries up into the lake. I'm sorry, I took them out of the refrigerator. Same ones that you saw me rinse off yesterday. That I might have it today. And I wasn't sure. Thinking, when is she gonna drink that juice? <coughs> <coughs> and then we'll put these little rosacea cups. Let's put these out. since I've been in the kitchen and uh, making the juice. Okay, so all of that is done. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm just cooking this stuff. I can tell by the way my head is feeling. Cooking it or using or smoking or something. Oh, okay, so that's in here. I need the spoon. And I'm just going to have a couple of little black berries. I tell you what I am going to do is 
once I got that, that juice down. I'm gonna pour that juice that came out of the uh, berries, as they thought, right on in there. Yeah, when I did it right this time, I could see the layer of apple down there, and uh, yeah, the layer of apple and uh, celery down there. It rested at the bottom, even when the uh, carrot juice came out. This, I don't know that I'm, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know that I'm going to drink all of that. I might. That, that's a lot to drink. Yeah, that's a 
better deal. I'm gonna mess up any more too. So it's over here sitting. Let me see what the lily does. This is not allowed, strings. I gotta stop it. And I also gotta get back to doing my live strings. I like doing live strings, but I've been doing stuff that I want to post on a regular basis. So you're posting stuff on a regular basis. So my soapy water. Sorry about that view. My brother tells people that I'm nasty. He don't like me. <laughs> and he comes in. The last time he was there, he picked up the pillow like this by the corner. Put it someplace and sat back in the chair. But that was back at the old place. Uh, I guess a year ago. Over a year ago. And I just looked at him like, yeah, he's just a sorry ass. <laughs> I ain't never been nothing nasty about me. But when somebody is trying desperately to make it seem like you're crazy and make it seem like you're evil and try to get people to understand why they don't want anything to do with you. They say anything about you. They say anything about you. I could list a whole lot of things that are nasty, but I'm not into trying to embarrass people. You know, sometimes things pop into your head. I could tell people a whole lot of stuff about him. <coughs> Yep. She nasty. She ain't clean. She don't even know how to wash a dish. She act like they don't know what she's doing. Tell them whatever you need to tell them. Make sure you get to have control of whatever money you have found your way to, right? Sometimes I think that maybe he loved my ex more than I did. <clears throat> or did you just love his money? Okay, so uh, that's a whole nother can of worms. I ain't gonna go there, just popped into my head. Okay, so I have not my way out of the kitchen. I'll show you. It's nice, neat, and clean. It is nice, neat, and clean. I just got to go back in, in there. Uh, and uh, turn off the sterilization part in about five minutes. But that's my kitchen. Okay, yeah, my place is dark. It is. And uh, I really need to go. I'm going to go over there and, first of all, if you turn the light around, make for more, more, a more better picture. I might make for a more better picture. Uh, I'm not going to turn this light on in here. some of my juice. And yeah, people, I am at this point tired. And I'll probably be going to bed around 10. Um, the only thing I need to do is 
take my bike ride and I'm going to show you I'm going to set it up in this video so you'll see my setup before I end this video and, uh, I'm not going to upload this video until uh, Hold on. I could, I could just turn the light because there's a light right there. I'm not going to upload this video. I'm looking for something. Until uh, I have finished with my bike ride. Is what I'm not going to do. So it begins with me pushing these two containers. I really wish there was a light in the hallway. But, you know, I just realized that there is a light in there. And that light in that <laughs> closet, <laughs> I could, I guess I could use that instead of the ring light, but I don't want to. So I just slid that over there. That's where it sits. Those containers will probably sit there when it's empty as well. Empty as well. And this is going to become easier once I get this extension cord. There's an extension cord that um, what I need. It's not really an extension cord. It's a. Uh, it's not an outlet box. We went through this before. I can't remember what it's called. But I'll show you. It's similar. It's similar to one of these. It is one of these. It's just not this brand. And it's got the USB charging stations on there. And I'm gonna get one of those because of course the outlet is right here. And I needed to go to that. And I'll just leave it sitting on here. So anyway, let me put this down because I'm making you dizzy. I'm setting this up and then I am uh, take this lamp because it's got that thing on there that USB charging port on there that I, I need and then I plug this light into it now I know people are saying why don't you just plug it into your computer because when I plug it into the computer, it messes the computer up. And it also messes the light up. The light will be unsteady. Yes, the light will be unsteady. Turn off the sterilization pot. I turned it off so you don't have to worry about it. I turned off the sterilization pot. You don't have to worry. So, um, I know you're thinking, well, you got your bike sitting right there. It's all in the way. The bike usually just sits right there, but y'all know that, right? But uh, I prefer this as a background now. And so since those containers are always sitting over there anyway, I put it right there. Plug the light in. And uh, I do an hour long ride with it like this. And then I put it back into place. 
and it's on wheels just push it right over there I put the bike back into place and then in the evening around this time I just turn the bike around again that's all and uh, <clears throat> sit the computer right there but I am gonna simplify it I am gonna simplify it but it's when I when I simplify it, it's still gonna require me to turn the, the bike twice a day And I'll continue to do that until I get tired of it. But uh, as I said, I like this setup. And people with that said, shown, dead, and done. <laughs> I'm going to uh, end this video. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoy tuning in to the juicing video even though I didn't really change the recipe it's really not about me changing the recipe everything I do in my videos that you see before it is about the conversation like I'm always going to be juicing until you know I get off track but I'm going to be juicing and there's a particular juice I like to drink I will switch it up every now and then but for now the ingredients that I bought those are the ones that I'm going to use, and I'm going to use all of them before I bring in some more juicing stuff because I'm not about to let my stuff go bad in the refrigerator. I'm not going to buy more than I need. It's bad enough to deliver those messed up mushrooms. Had my mouth all sick. I'm drinking this too fast. And I'm going to follow that um, with a bottle of water. I got this half a bottle of water left over from earlier. And then that other bottle I took out, I'll be nursing that tonight. So I go to bed. Because I, I drank some water today, people. I drank some water. And, uh, yeah, after I take my... Uh, I drink a lot of water because I take cholesterol pills and you got to drink a lot of water. And so I'm pretty sure there'll be two more bottles of water that I drink tonight after I take that pill. And uh, and that's the other reason I wish I could take my cholesterol pill. Because I drink most of my water during the daytime. So anyway, what was I saying? Um, yeah, I'm going to drink that half a bottle of water over there. And the time is now 8.24, so it, that's a good time. Because <clears throat> normally I would, um, about 8, 8.30, I'd be getting on the bike to ride for 10, 15 minutes just to unwind before I head off to bed. So, um... Yeah, I'm okay with uh, starting this video, this last biking video, my 15th mile for the day um, at 8.24. And I got enough battery power left to do it. I would be feeling better right now, but the fumes and the gases and stuff in the kitchen hit me. And so it's messing with me right now. And I can't remember, I was going to tell you something. But I forgot what it was, and I start talking about water <clears throat> and explaining all that. But anyway, um, thank you for joining me for this video. Um, yeah, I was talking about juices. Um, I'm going to be biking. It's going to be 30 minutes. What I talk about and the sounds we hear, the ASMR sounds we hear will be different. In fact, I'll be using the other sound machine probably tomorrow. That one has like 30 sounds. Y'all haven't heard those. <laughs> Y'all heard, heard two of them. This is just so good. So, um, yeah, just a conversation with change. My juices 
my juice concoctions mixtures are not meant to impress it's just about what I want the same way when I do my mukbangs they're not meant to impress or my cooking videos this is what I feel like eating but I have a craving for um, plain and simple in that moment um, now over on my other channel when I start baking my cakes and I, I meant to do one this weekend but I we'll see how Sunday goes um, I have all the ingredients I don't really need the vanilla extract I have all the other cake ingredients it's just a matter of uh, doing I want the quality of it the, it's still gonna be keeping it real when I do it over there on Unique Expressions uh, Decor and More and uh, it's still not going to be done in an impressive way but I want it to be a little bit better I want nice uh, dishes and stuff to you know display it in and um, <clears throat> I want to have the stuff laid out so it doesn't take me 15 years to do the video and just you know uh, have it all laid, light, all laid out and just you know tell you what the measurements are, put it in, mix it up, and uh, pour it into the, to the pans and stuff. And, yeah, I want to do that and uh, kind of keep it simple. And, uh, but I think I pretty much got the, uh, I'm kind of testing it out with the juicer and the position of positioning of the camera and I just put in a new light bulb in the kitchen and uh, you know, I'm testing it out because that's going to be my workstation right there and uh, when I start baking I'm just going to push either uh, the coffee pot and the juicer back or just put them right there in the closet because I got it in the closet in the dining room <clears throat> because I have made a uh, I have cleared a shelf so that I can just put it in there on the day that I'm going to be, be baking and don't have to, you know, do a whole lot of special stuff. So, yeah. Just my baking is, is intended to be impressive, but the rest of my cooking videos on this channel, that, that's not, I'm not trying to impress anybody. I'm just, you know, sister girl want a cheeseburger, sister girl want a tuna fish sandwich, just some french fries. It's as simple as that. Spoon and egg salad into my mouth. But, uh, yeah. I want to make some really nice desserts. I want to, <clears throat> oh, and just so that you know, I'm just following a basic cake, uh, recipe because I'm trying to make I want these to be simple for the people for the cakes I'm doing basic and I'm making up my own stuff from scratch you know flour eggs all that stuff um, so I'm just it's sort of like being on the cake wars or whatever it's not a real recipe that you're following it's just your basic cake ingredients for a certain size pan is what I'm doing and so um, my icings and all that other stuff. I'm not going to be following a recipe. I'm bringing to you what I what I create, what I come up with, and then there'll be some other desserts. Um, there'll be some other desserts uh, occasionally where I'll make a pie, and so the cakes and the cookies. I'm kind of winging it from basic cake and cookie ingredients. And then when it comes to the pies and the tarts and stuff, that kind of stuff, I'll be following recipes, but, you know, taking out what I don't like and adding what I do like and making it my own. So that's how that's going to go. Um, now, with that said, thank you very much for joining me today. Stay safe, my people. Remember to give someone hope in every day and every day because it's a very easy thing to do. If you have not subscribed, please do so. If you have not hit the like button, please do so. If you have not checked out my Amazon wish list page, please do so. If you can, Sister Girl would appreciate a donation through my Cash App. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good night. Peace.